Hey hi hello welcome back to my new video this is Sampati watching Sampath Samfix YouTube channel and this is Poco F3 of the Xiaomi Mi 11X or the Redmi K40 custom ROM is back with again hyper OS build this is latest version and the different UI guys if I go into my device you can check out Xiaomi hyper OS by EMM OS 1.0.24.3.18. developer beta edition this is and if I go here I have added 6 GB of memory extension and if I go into detailed information specifications you can see the specs but the OS version I already said Android version is 14 here and model number and baseband kernel user is 4.19.273 VK X kernel has been used here security patch uh, result where it is we'll go, yeah here it is the March security patch that's really good latest security patch here in this particular rom will come back here we'll start with the home screen and home screen customization quick setting styles home screen looks like this if i press and hold this one yeah you actually can edit this and i want to keep like this not supported for this particular icon we'll do one thing for themes we'll edit it yeah one into two it's also not supported here anyhow for example at least gallery yeah edit and no not supported i don't know why it's not getting supported yeah now it is getting supported oh no default only yeah it's getting downloaded this is how you can actually edit the icons here it is taking some time to download i have very good internet connection but i don't know why it's taking some time anyhow we'll come back here it will take some time i will adjust these icons you can actually edit the icon shape size and completely the image of the icon you can do that and there's a quick settings toggles completely hyper as this is if i press and hold edit yeah you get these extra options but most of the options i have already added you can check out here and it's kind of white and black monochrome kind of uh, look it has and this is typical app drawer we get and we'll check that home screen customization here itself yeah arrange items in the recents you get stacking horizontally you can even select ios a recent style like this we have more apps i'll show you within a while hide status bar in the recents show memory status blur app reviews hide recent task card app name and card app icon you can do that entering the recent task pass page animation you can actually set them there are some customization indeed and regarding navigation you get both buttons and gestures that's quite similar home screen again with app drawer light mode classic has been given backgrounds again you get these options here transparency let's keep 100 percent anyhow scroll bar and group icons by color those things are remain same here this always hidden auto you can make it out icon style again you get these options here uh, background color options some of the options will get but it is based on the theme application double tap to sleep enable blur uh, ambiguity yeah that's there and advanced material number of this everything is there regarding customization it's an endless customization this is a hyper OS build guys and you can check out by pausing the video these are the customization you get in the home screen this is regarding the home screen and regarding dialer here you get proper hyper OS dialer you get direct video call support and there is a call recording feature also and do not disturb mode everything is fine working fine no problem regarding that guys and camera application you get proper hyper OS camera as you can see in the video mode you actually get documents that's there in the video you get only 4k 30 fps no 60 fps option here and other options you can check out in the more these are the options you need to download it once it get downloaded you can use them everything is working fine no need to worry regarding that and security application check out description guys for flashing method and firmware used and what all the mods available in this particular room you can check out there these are the inbuilt apps available as you can see this is regarding the uh, security application this is the latest one hyper is built and tools you get these things and regarding weather application let me enable no cancel and give it someplace yeah 
that's how this is also updated in the weather application if you want you can add the uh, widgets from here or press and hold here you get widgets and wallpapers again these things will not get downloaded for some reason i don't know uh, in some of the roms it will get downloaded and these uh, other wallpapers based on hyperos are still available and you can choose the widgets from here as you can see and some other app settings like uh, here they have added pulsar plus uh, app here you can check out albums artists folders genres songs you can actually select them from here and uh, whatsapp is available notes again you also get me canvas you can install them this has been updated all the apps are updated and modded here no need to worry regarding that in the gallery actually i'll show some results also like this okay uh, geekbench is getting crashed after 100 percent and this is anti to benchmark results gpu is also again showing zero you can add a uh, 3 lakh or 2 lakh 40 also it is around 7 lakhs only anyhow this is the score what i got and 5.7 degrees celsius was the temperature raise and 4 percent of battery has been dropped during this testing and this is the read write uh, sequential read write and random read write and memory copy test using numerical details here and this is graphical representation and this is safety net status guys uh, basic integrity and status profile match both are getting passed here and you can also see the play store certification has been done and this is the, the drm information you get hdr 10 support and level 1 certified and this is the internet speed what i got using atl fiber and this is the charging speeds i mean 33 watt charging supports are available i have used neck band and even the earbuds also everything is working fine here uh, before going into settings we'll complete that gallery here yeah as you can see uh, in this you also get these options recognize table text everything is available here there's a new version of uh, galleries also updated in my opinion there are some more features also if you have wallpapers you can even edit them like this you also get some filters and again create other options like sky changing mode everything is given sticker beautify plenty are given once you flash this from definitely utilize that gallery editor even video editing options are also available inbuilt in this particular ROM this Pulsar Plus is pre-installed here for a video player if you want you can use that and via browser is also pre-installed if you want to use other one you can use that and we'll go into settings here this is smooth and responsive guys nowadays for me 11x every hyperos builds are getting very much smooth uh, that's a good sign in interconnectivity you get all these options if you want to turn that on you can turn this on as you can see and even the mm, more options you get all the imp important options are available wallpapers and personalization again this uh, lock screen customizations are available as you can see yeah all the options are available you can actually customize them uh, filter as you can see i will apply this and no matter effect this time and give it apply and turn on the always on display will show you this is how the lock screen looks like face unlock is very much quick anyhow and theme section is there wallpaper i already shown always on display again you can keep it out always also that's fine and you can customize them and you can install number of presets are available even in the theme section fonts again you get some options here oh no it should be here anyhow and effects again you get plenty here my personal favorite is starlight anyhow and this regarding wallpapers and customization personalization lock screen again you get plenty of options here too charging animations you can customize notification status bar you get battery indicator outside inside notch in individual app if certain app is not playing you can actually select always show notch if it is not playing full screen control center style you can select old and new uh, you can also switch them and don't show icon labels and collapse shops or touch that is the smart device controls you can add here and notification effect again you, it will revert back to these settings and home screen customization already said about that display and brightness again you get light mode and dark mode dark mode is in pitch black condition what is missing here is the sunlight mode there is smooth and transition but auto brightness is there let me turn this off yeah now the sunlight mode is available advanced textures color scheme again you get all the options here 
and flicker mode is there color scheme i already said reading mode options are available refresh it you get default and in the custom you actually get 60 90 and 120 ai imagine engine here only two options are given let me enable this one motion emission motion control is also available here and fingerprint face unlock and screen lock is there by default it will be in the press make it uh, touch here and stay on the lock screen you can disable from here that is there this all the screen unlocking options will show you within a while that and battery again you get four different modes performance modes will be utilized while gaming uh, let's check that also within a while screen time again this is a digital well-being guys and in the additional settings you get gesture shortcuts again you can assign them as you can see and language and input and region many of the regions has been added now and regarding languages also if you go into languages again these are limited not that much regarding language but regions everything has been added here other settings like gesture shortcuts i already explained accessibility menu again you get vision hearing physical everything are working fine here one and eight mode is also available as you can see this is little bit difficult guys as you can see by swiping that's yeah they should give this option a little bit apo and clear speaker is there floating windows are also given memory extension at the start i said up to 6 gb is given second space account and sync enterprise mode is given here regarding fingerprint unlock i will show you right now as you can see it's very much fast and accurate and face unlock again you can check out the uh, lock screen customization let me show you yeah this is how it looks like it's really cool and if you see it's get unlocked both fingerprint and face unlock are very much quick and fast to unlock your smartphone let's see speed test here all the apps are opening quick and fast here no need to worry regarding that guys and this are the recent apps what i said ios kind of style you get it that's cool here this of the ui it's really really good and some features like this dynamic island you guys can see even while connecting charger also it will show the similar kind of notification here and this is the volume panel what we can get and advanced restart button is also available in this particular app you can directly reboot to recovery we'll say bgmi how it handle and wind up this video this is a volume panel what we can get in this particular room and this is how the uh, game turbo mode i already enabled the performance mode here i also enabled this bright and saturated and you can actually clear the memory from here and use some of the apps directly and you can actually announce the visuals and use voice changer let's see how it actually handles in this particular room Fine. Yeah, that is so funny. Anyhow, this how it is handled. Even in counter attacks, there is no lag, and I am using Wi-Fi connection guys, Airtel. It depends upon the network connection also. I just missed the streak. Anyhow, I will come back here, and I want to show one more thing uh, regarding Google Photos, guys. Uh, you get actually unlimited photo storage here. And if you're still not subscribed to my YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button, guys, and also allow the bell notification by pressing the bell icon. And if you like the video, give it a like, and you can actually check out here unlimited photo storage is available in this particular rom no need to worry about that everything is fine here that's an added uh, extra feature for you bonus feature but overall it's a very good rom i can say you can definitely try it out as a daily driver but there are some other alternatives also you can check out that 
and that's it guys this is sampath we'll meet with another interesting video guys until that keep smiling bye bye for now